Hello, hi, my name is Mzee Daro Trondwa, the guy with the YouTube channel. Thanks for getting back to me and I will definitely assist you for free. Now, if you are having a challenge with your ProLine laptop or with any brand of your laptop, stuck on fe.ufe shell or startup.nsh, it's one and the same thing, or it's start on the official version 2.70 solution, it's still the same, same thing. Or it's saying mapping problem. Or you switch it on and then it's tagged on the yellow page and it says press ask in less than five seconds. It's still the same problem. I've been doing videos and bringing the solution regarding the same problem. And some of the videos are hitting 40Ks, 50Ks, 30K views. Um, I have also listed my WhatsApp number there whereby i assist people for free in fixing that and please understand this you can't fix the problem that you do not know and now when it comes to this every problem there has to be three things it's either the first one or second one or third one it's either the hard drive crashed or the boot order scheduled or the windows crashed it's only these three and sometimes you do not know which one it is right so i'm here to assist you with three of them now if you are switching on your laptop and then it's tagged on that page please press ctrl press and hold it with your left hand ctrl with your left hand again press and hold a l t button and then with your right hand, press delete. The laptop will go off and come on again. When it comes on, it will try to repair itself. Then if it says repairing system, then get the windows. Plug it. Be it saved on the USB or CD. Plug it and then repair the system. That means then the, C the windows was at the verge of crashing. Or the windows has crashed it needs to be installed afresh another thing if that's not the case if when doing that CTRL ALT and delete it comes back to the yellow page again or it come to utility page this is what you can do now if it comes to yellow page switch it off switch it on before it fully switches on, press ESC button. It will jump to a utility page. Now, on the utility page, go to a boot page. On the boot, check on the list. You'll find where it's written. Am I too fast? Okay. Now, check on the list where it's written. Boot option hashtag one press enter there there will be options that will pop up there if it's normal there has to be three and more if it's less than three then we're having a problem now the option that we are looking for there it is windows boot manager if your your windows boot option is scheduled you find that it's on disable it's on a feed audio official now take it back to windows boot manager when you take it to windows boot manager then the laptop or computer will then read the the windows and switch on all right if there is no windows boot manager and it's only a feed audio official and disabled only these two Please, for the last time, try CTRL, ALT, and delete. And then when you switch on, go back again on the utility page. Uh, boot option, hashtag one. And if you realize that there is still disable and there is um, a feed on your official only, then that means the hard drive has crashed you will have to replace the hard drive these are the three keys
And this is the result of laptop having fallen or hit against something. It's either Windows boot scheduled, hard drive crashed, or Windows crashed. These are the three things. If you try all of them and they are not working, my WhatsApp is free. I assist people for free. Take my WhatsApp number. I will also put it on this video. I will ping it on the first comment. Come to my WhatsApp inbox. Holler me. State the problem. I will assist you for free. I have done the video fixing uh, Windows crashed. You can go and check it. I have done the video fixing uh, the same problem when the boot order has scheduled. You can go and check it. I have done the very same video fixing um when the hard drive has crashed you can go and check the video or on the very same video come to my inbox on the comment there i will answer you come to my whatsapp i will answer you for free my name is mzeda rotondwa thank you so much for watching my video and coming back to my youtube channel Make sure that you subscribe, you like, and you share. God bless you.